so eight students are given internship offer at a really good stipend amount of rupees 45000 well next company which visited the campus is arm which is a processor based company they arranged various shortlisting rounds so in iit mandi you also get access to the cadence tool you can design your circuits your project works with the help of phds and even some of these students have got opportunity in psus so they have just left out the mtech hey everyone welcome back to the channel i am jashan hope you all are doing well so today in this video, we are going to see the internship offers of VLSI students in IIT Mandi and we are going to see the offers of the latest uh, year 2024. For those who are new to my channel, let me tell you that I cover videos related to VLSI insights and I also cover like latest advancements in the VLSI industry and along with this, we also cover videos related to the latest placements and uh, internship offers of various institutes all over India like IITs, NITs, BITs and all other private and government institutions so as the application of ai machine learning and networking is increasing in our daily lives so the vlsi industry is growing at this at the great great pace so that's why i create videos related to vlsi industry so if you have your interest in these kind of things these kind of advancements in the networking and all so you can consider subscribing my channel today in this video we are going to see the internship offers given by various industries of vlsi in the iit mandi so if we talk about the iit mandi it is performing really well in the past uh, various years because they have shown like 90 to 100 percent placements in in the past years whenever students write gate exam they might not get uh, that much good gate score so that they can uh, land up with a good iit or old iits like delhi bombay kanpur etc so uh, they have options to choose uh, new iits and iit mandi roper all these kind of iits are the new iits so it is always a good option to choose iit mandi if you're looking for vlsi branch because for old iits you need really uh, 900 plus get score for uh, VLSI branch or microelectronics branch so you can always have an option to choose IIT Mandi uh, in VLSI branch I always say that VLSI expertise has huge demand in the semiconductor industry and AI your skill set your uh, practical experience on your project work during your studies can surely land you up with a good profile job in the semiconductor industry but for that you have to build your basic skill set and your basic knowledge about the VLSI sector and uh, after that you can surely crack the interview I have already covered various videos regarding the skill set you require to crack the interviews. You can check out those videos. Now moving to the IIT Mandi's internship offers. Today we will see the performance of students of IIT Mandi VLSI branch and we're gonna see the number of companies visited the IIT Mandi campus and we're also gonna see the stipend amount they offered and job location they offered, which core companies visited the campus and each company hired how many students. So all of these kind of doubts I will clear in this video. But before stating the figures, let me tell you that IIT Mandi allows MTech VLSI students to join 12 months internship in semiconductor industries and in your second year itself. So it's a huge advantage for MTech student because they can utilize their second year for being in the industry. So you don't need, you don't have to do any coursework. You can just join the industry for 12 months internship. So by this, you can save your one year of life. Although it is not mandatory to join the internship, if you have your interest in research work, you can also choose to do 12 months project under your guide in IIT Mandi itself. But if you are looking for placements or internship offers, then you can surely join internship offer from where industries in your second year of mtech itself earlier this 12 month internship in second year was suspended in iit mandi due to some circumstances but right now due to good administration it has again resumed now let me tell you the name of company which visited the campus and those are intel cadence which is an eda tool based company and then mediatek nxp arm and the last one is which has recently achieved two trillion dollar market cap and it is a fastest growing company in semiconductor industry and that is nvidia so these companies have visited the iit mandi campus for internship offers in the year 2023 to 24 now let's talk about the number of students hired by intel so intel hired maximum number of students among all the visited companies and it is eight so eight students are given internship offer at a really good stipend amount of rupees 45 000. i think it's a good amount to start your your career even when you haven't completed your mtech and if we talk about the location of your job then it is the best location if you want to grow your package and if you want to grow financially and it is bangalore so for 12 months you have to relocate to bangalore and it has the highest number of chances to being converted uh, for full-time offer 
so tell a good company to join for internship now the next company which visited the campus is nvidia so nvidia hired only one student from iit mandi for the internship offer and if we talk about the stipend offered and it it is the highest stipend offered from all the companies and it is 75000 indian rupees so it's a whooping amount for a student if only the stipend is rupees 75000 you can imagine the ctc offer after you get conversion into full time and let me tell you it's worth more than 30 to 40 lakhs now if we talk about the job location they offered it is bangalore location for your knowledge let me tell you that once you get full time offer from nvidia after the internship then you get company stocks and those are us based stock market uh, stocks so the employees who had joined nvidia 2 3 years back they have gained 100 to 200 percent return on investment on the stocks because the stock of nvidia has risen a long today its price is almost 1000 dollar so if you are getting into nvidia it's a lucky draw received from your hard work now moving to the next company which visited the campus and it is mediatek so mediatek also offered only one student for the 12 month internship this offer is being given for the bangalore location at a stipend of rupees 54000 per month last year also this company had visited iit mandi campus and and they hired one student and that student is currently being converted into full-time so uh, it's a good chance to get uh, into full-time offer even once you get into the media tech for internship so it's a good deal well next company which visited the campus is arm which is a processor based company they arranged various shortlisting rounds for the uh, students but uh, unfortunately none of the students could crack the interview and they did not choose any student for the internship offer but i think that's a bad luck for arm because any student who has done coursework and project work of vlsi with full heart so he or she is any worth to be offered so if you are not selected for any reason in any company then there are no reason to be worried because uh, there are tremendous opportunities waiting with better packages Nevertheless, a next company which visited the campus of IIT Mandi for the internship offer and that is NXP Semiconductors. So this company hired two students for the internship and they offered a good stipend amount of rupees for 42,500 and it is per month. Again, this offer has been given for the Bangalore location. So NXP was about to be merged into Qualcomm in the year 2016, but due to some reasons, it could not uh, be merged into Qualcomm. But still, this company has grown really well in the past few years. Now, next company which visited the campus is popular among EDA tool providers, and it is Cadence. So Cadence offered three students for the internship offer, and it is again for the Bangalore location. The stipend amount which they have given to the offered students, and it is 45 5,000 per month and all of the students which have been given offer they are hired for the analog profile for your knowledge let me tell you that cadence tools and synopsis tools are the most important tools to design a circuit so there are various uh, production based companies which uh, use these tools to uh, design the circuits and analog circuits digital circuits etc so in iit mandi you also get access to the cadence tool you can design your circuits uh, your project works with the help of phds or your guide as you know there are various technology nodes in uh, in semiconductors like there are 130 nanometer we used to do and right now we are going towards 5 nanometer 3 nanometer even 1 nanometer so these kind of nodes you can also access in cadence tool in iit mandi you can have access to cadence 130 nanometer node 90 nanometer node even 65 nanometer and as low as 28 nanometer node as well so it's a unique thing and i think really a good thing to join iit mandi so with this we have seen that six companies have visited the iit mandi campus in the financial year 2023 to 2024 and they have given offers to 16 students of iit mandi well if you would ask me about the total number of students of this batch then let me tell you that it is a batch of total 25 number of students so all of these students have joined iit mandi in the year 2023 now among the leftover students who could not get any opportunity for the internship they will get their opportunity in very time soon and even some of these students have got opportunity in psus so they have just left out the mtech uh, in between and have joined psus so that's a uh, personal decision at all this was all about the internship offers of latest batch of iit mandi mtech vlsi so if you are new to my channel again i would request you to uh, subscribe my channel and if you have any doubts you can just email me or you can just uh, insta uh, message me on instagram i will definitely reply you so thank you so much for watching this video thank you